Hi, I'm Zach Noyle, 25 years old from Honolulu, Hawaii. I'm a surf photographer for Surfer Magazine. Growing up in Hawaii, you, you are constantly surrounded around the beach. Your daily activities, your weekends, your family events are all based around the water. My father is a commercial photographer, so using that ability of having the photography and my love for the ocean just came natural for me. As a surfer, going in the ocean, you see the beauty of the waves and underwater and the barrel and just the beauty of the islands. And finding a way that I could convey that to a normal person that wouldn't be going out in the waves or the water, like my mom or family or different things like that, was a, just a natural fit for me to be able to share with the other people. I did photography for several years as a hobby and would shoot pictures of my friends, go to Sandy Beach, just play around, small disposable camera, started upgrading slowly. I then started getting more and more interested in the professional side of it, of shooting professional surfers, selling gallery prints and different things, and it just kept progressing from there to where it is today. And it's kind of all happened really fast for me, and I still can't believe, you know, Three years ago, I was just shooting, playing at Sandy Beach, and now I'm shooting for a Surfer Magazine, traveling the world. And it was definitely a learning process. You go out to Pipeline, think you're in great shape, you'll get pounded around and put in the right place. You always gotta be in the top shape and I've kind of learned that where you need to train year round and this is your job to be training to be in the best shape so that you can go into the water and perform at an optimal level. You're shooting these athletes but in a sense you are an athlete too where you have to be swimming out to 12 foot pipeline, big barrels, be diving, swimming, fighting the current, get yourself in, hold a 10 pound camera, I was offered a staff position with Transworld Surf. And I took that position and they started paying for some travel here and there to go. I went to Philippines, Easter Island, Australia, Indonesia, Tahiti, Mexico, California, Oregon. So it was a really exciting time in my life when I got that and was able to travel and do something that I love and was so passionate about. It was like a dream come true, really. I got offered a position at Surfer Magazine. It was not an easy decision because Transworld was so good to me and the people that worked there were just so amazing. But I knew to take that next step in my career and progress myself, I had to go with the Bible of surfing, which was Surfer Magazine. Been around the longest, most respected, Beautiful quality of imagery in there. When I signed with Surfer, I was like, I'm gonna get you guys a cover. And they're like, we hope you get a few. I was like, I'm gonna get you a cover. And to have it happen within my first month is just such an honor and I'm so thankful and really blessed. It's just been an amazing ride and I can never take it for granted. You just always gotta be thankful in what you have.